Now, the election battle is underway for control of one of the world's great cities, which is about to host one of the world's biggest events. Londoners go to the polls in less than a month to choose between the eccentric incumbent and the man who once had the job and now wants it back. Lisa Miller reports from London. If the Boris bus is in town, the mayor can't be far away, taking every vote ruining opportunity to keep the top job. Pattern on your spot on me the third. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. He's considered eccentric and slightly shambolic, his messy blonde hair making him instantly recognisable. Boris Johnson has made it a popular formula against an opposition he describes as... Taxpayer-funded Chateau Neuf du Pape swilling out of London, ignoring car-hating semi-reformed Trotskyists and bendy bus fetishists. <laughs> And this is his rival, the former mayor of London, Ken Livingstone, who wants his job back after four years on the outer. We're standing because we want to represent all Londoners. It's an election rerun with no love lost. A battle over personal taxes ended in an off-camera expletive-laden row. Not that that bothers the mayor's fan base. Boris says what he means and he delivers. He's not a clone, he's not a template politician. He could get elected back in Australia. <laughs> With the London Olympics providing a global stage for the winner, the stakes are high. There's growing speculation that Boris Johnson's ambitions are greater than City Hall, that he wants to turn this kind of celebrity appeal into a successful run for the Prime Ministership. Not that he'll admit to it. Is it true that people would like to see you in Downing Street? No, no, I don't think so. No. Hello, good afternoon. Hi. Sorry to trouble you. But it is a local council election, and in the end, the clash of egos could be decided over taxes and train tickets. Lisa Miller, ABC News, London. Boris Johnson, if he wasn't real, you'd have to invent him. We need more of him out here, don't we? He's very, very entertaining as a, as a, as a mayor, and before that, um, as a politician.